What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back, and yes, guys, I got another making stuffs video for you guys. But before we get into it, let's hit that 20 like button. Oh my gosh, let's hit the 20 like button for your boy. We almost hit it in a last my last video. We're at 15. I'm giving away stubs if we hit 20, guys. Run it up, run up the comments, comment 10k every single day. I'm doing this once we get to 20 likes. I'll be giving away 5 to 10k to one random person. It's going to be 10k. 10k to one random person. Got to comment 10k in the comments though. Let's run it up. Let's subscribe to your boy. All that good stuff. Let's run it up. I just hit 150. Let's get to 200 in the next week or so. I'm grinding will be. But guys, I'm sorry because I have work every day. I'm going to just keep posting stuff videos for you guys because I got work every day. I can't. My level's low. It's shot, but Man, I'm gonna be grinding tonight at like nine o'clock. But anyways, if you guys have any questions about anything, stub making methods, fantasy baseball, whatever, hit up the comments. Uh, but yeah, 10k in the comments for if we get 20 likes. Um, one random person will be receiving 10k stubs, and may, but we have to get 20 likes. Let's run it up. Tell your friends. Let's get to 20 likes. One random person will get 10k in the comments. So let's get it. All right, let's get into the video. This video is pickups of the week, okay? We're gonna go over guys who are expensive in stubs and also cheap. So, okay, let's get into this. So, ready to begin with my favorite pickup of the week, okay? Number one is Jacob DeGrom because everybody knows how nasty this guy is. He is the Cy Young Mets fan, as I am, yes. He's the Cy Young, he's a stud. I freaking love him. He's definitely going to go open overall. Either not this week, maybe next week. He's definitely going to open overall. I do not see him slowing down. We saw him to an extension. He's a complete stud. Go cop it if you got the stubs. If you don't, I don't know what to tell you. Another one. Man. Corey Cooper for this price. You know what to do. Go cop that. Hold up. I got a really good one, okay? Hold up. Where is it? Where is this man? There it is. Okay, guys. Christian freaking Yelich. All right. The pickup of the week. Why? Because he hit four home runs in his first four games, and he's batting 500 through the first week. Why would this guy ever go down in overall? He is the reigning MVP. He's a complete stud. I have him in fantasy. He is tearing it apart. No offense, but uh, Poodles Gaming, shout out to you, but you're getting your ass worked in fantasy. But, uh... <laughs> Christian Yelich is working him. But, uh, all right. So, let's go. Let's keep going. Christian Yelich, my top pickup of the week. He's probably going to go up to, like, an 87 minimum. 100% going to one overall, yo. Like, he's literally breaking records right now. Let's go. Let's keep going through the list. JD Martinez, big pickup. 85 overall. Why is this guy an 85 overall? Don't ask me. He is going to go up in overall. He's literally a top five hitter. He's so freaking good. And he's on Boston. Boston Red Sox, the best team in MLB. Still, they're stacked. Okay. All right, let's go. Okay, Chris Bryant, he's doing okay. Maybe you want to pick him up? Not sure. Uh, Javier Baez is doing good, but he's too overpriced, in my opinion. Uh, let's keep going. Uh, Garrett Cole, pick him up. He's too cheap. Way, way too cheap. Go pick that card up. Let's see what else we got over here. Giancarlo, do not pick this card up. He is injured. Do not pick him up. Nope. Let's see. Let's keep going through this. Trey Turner. Oh, yes. Okay. I'm actually about to go pick up this card right now. This guy is about to be a diamond anytime, any any moment, guys. He just hit a walk-off home run. He had two home runs last game, last night. <coughs> Complete stud. Super young. Got the speed. Wait till his power's upgraded. Holy crap. Stud. He's going to be a diamond probably this week, maybe. We'll see. Uh, let's see. Carrasco, do not pick him up. Got lit up. Nope, do not recommend. Oh, Blake Trinan. Okay. He could be a good pickup. He has a couple saves already. The A's are looking nice so far. Good pickup. Let's go. Uh, Okuna, eh, big fan. He's doing okay. Don't pick him up. Snell, do not pick up. He got lit up. Uh, Trevor Bauer, I'm not sure about. Let's keep going. We got Sev. He did okay. Rizzo. Rizzo. Rizzo's doing good. Um, he just hit a dinger yesterday. You might want to go pick this up. Not a bad pickup. 
JT Ramuto, not your story. And okay, Marte is not doing bad. Maybe a good pickup. Xander Bogarts just got a contract extension. I don't know if he's doing that good. Let's pull up the stats quick. Let's see how the boy Xander Bogarts is doing this week. And he is not doing that good. So do not pick up that card. Uh, let's keep going. Matt Chapman. Oh, yeah. Hold on. Do I have stubs? Yes, I do. I'm copying this card, yo. I feel like this guy, he's really proven himself. And I really, really think he's going to become a diamond this year. He is so talented, man. He's an awesome third baseman. Awesome hitter. The A's still the lowest. They're the budget baller team. They're tearing it apart, man. Congrats to the A's. I am, man. Oh, yeah. And another pickup. We're about to get to him. Donaldson, don't pick him up. No, no, no. Don't pick these guys up. Nope. Ben Tendi, not doing that good so far. You Darvish did pretty good the other day. Not bad. Miggy, no. No Ozzy. Ozzy's doing trash. Murphy got injured on my fantasy team. I'm so tight. And we got that Matt Chapman. Let's go. So right there, I can make stubs off the Matt Chapman. All right, let's see what else we got. Uh, Wilson Ramos is doing bad. You, you could pick him up. He's doing pretty good. Literally one of the top catchers of the year. Let's see. Eddie Rosario. Eh. Mike Mikolas got lit up. Let's check Soto. Let's check his stats. Juan Soto. Ooh, he's doing terrible so far. He went 0 for 4 with 3 Ks. Ooh, last night. Uh, Cano, he had one good game. Nothing else. Carpenter's good. Okay. Why is he an 80 overall? This guy... Was a stud last year. I feel like that's disrespect. I feel like everyone should go pick up this card. He's so underrated. Go pick him up right now. Otani, nothing. He's not even playing. He's hurt. Cruz. Oh, yeah, yeah. Nelson Cruz. He's about to have 99 every hitting stat, guys. He just hit. He's a freaking monster. I'm pretty sure he already has like three home runs. Hold on. Let me check. Nelson Cruz a beast. Hold up. Nelson Cruz. He has one home run, but he's doing amazing. He's top 50 right now in the league. He's 4 for 11 in the start. Could be a good pickup, and it's Nelson Cruz. Don't see him slowing down. He's got a bat and a half. So, yeah, he's a good pickup. Mitch Hattiger is always a good pickup, man. This guy is so underrated. One of the most underrated hitters in the game. Average hitter. I love him. I had him last year in fantasy. Highly recommend him. Go pick him up. He's a stud. Rick Parcell pitched really good. They blew the game. He's a good pickup. Uh, so yeah, that's one of my top silver pickups. Hoskins, is, eh, he's, our, he's an okay pickup. Hold on, where is KH? Okay, Barreos, 100% pick him up. This guy's gonna be the ace of the league this year, I'm telling you. He just, first, first game he pitched, he had eight innings, no, 7.2 innings, and I think 10 Ks. I'm pretty sure right off the bat, I remember his stats, because I haven't fancy. Yeah, one win, 10 strikeouts, only one walk in 7.2 innings, and a win, so like, huge pickup right there. Uh, let's check. Where is KH Davis, man? All these guys are not that good at pickups. Nope, 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 nope. Michael Brantley could be a big, good, pick, good pickup. Not a bad pickup. DJ LeMayu is not even playing. He's trash. Alex Wood, eh. Where the hell is KH? Mill Myers could be a good pickup. He could be a good pickup. Uh, let's see. Hendricks just got a contract extension. He's decent. Joey Gallo, man. This guy strikes out. He he must he literally cannot see. I swear. He literally hits a home run or he strikes out. How is he doing though? He's doing pretty good actually. Hmm. This might this guy might be a pickup. If he could stop striking out so much and hit those 40 whatever home runs he did last year, he could be an easy, easy top player. Easily. Eric Hosmer's doing pretty good. Scooter Jeanette. Yo, just pick him up. He's injured right now, but just pick him up because he's so cheap. Unless you want to pick him up in a week or two. When he gets back, he's going to be a gold in no time. He's a stud. Where? Oh, Andrew McCutcheon. Yo, Andrew McCutcheon's doing amazing. Go pick him up. I really, I'm loving, I'm loving his new team. It's looking nice. I love it. Travis Shaw's doing okay. Glaber, nah. Belt, no. Nope, nope, nope. Gary Sanchez is doing terrible. Like, what? He had that one year, man. One freaking year. That's it, dude. Elvis Andre's doing amazing for me in fantasy. Go pick him up. He's doing awesome. Arietta did pretty good the other day. Evan Crashio's doing decent. Jesus Aguilar has done nothing at all. Uh, David Dow. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Go pick him up. He's going to break out this year. I'm telling everyone right now. Go pick him up. 
He's doing really good right now. If he doesn't get hurt, he will be a goal player in no time. He's very talented, but he's always hurt. Needs to stay healthy. Top one of my top pickups for silvers. But where the hell is the man himself? There it is, Chris freaking Davis. Everyone, go pick him up right now. This is my top silver. Him and Barreos and freaking Dal if he doesn't get hurt. Chris freaking Davis, guys. Oh my god. He is tur he's just a beast. Complete beast. That's all I gotta say. Literally, go pick him up right now. I'm about to pick him up. You know what? Yeah. He's gonna be a goal any anytime, yo. He is a freaking beast, man. He has four home runs already. Four home runs. He's a freaking tank. He's jacked out of his mind. Corey Dickerson's doing good too. Very underrated player. How can they botch his power? He's so good, man. Underrated as hell. JBJ. No, 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 no. I love JBJ, man. It's so nasty. None of these guys are nah. Cole Hamels got lit up. Cargo's not. Nah. Cargo's dead ass in the triple A. He's a silver. But yeah, guys, that's really all I got. I'm trying to find some bronze quick. Colton Wong. Okay, he could go up a little bit. Colton Wong's doing good. He's batting seventh. He's doing really good. Jerks and Profar could go up in overall. Not bad. Uh, Wilmer Flores is starting. He's not doing that good. All right, let's go. Let me just go over some quick bronze cards quick. None of these guys are good. No, 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 no. None of them are good, really. None, no one. Oh, Ryan Healy. He's all right. You can pick him up. He might go up in overall. But let me. Oh, Domingo Santana. Pick him up right now. He is going up. He is on the rise. This could be his breakout year that I've been waiting for. Yes, he's ranked five right now. He is doing unbelievable. You should go pick him up. I really have. I, honestly, that's really the only bronze card I can see. And Luke Voigt, yo. He's a big body. He needs some dangers. But yeah, guys, that's really all I got for you for the pickups of the week. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys listen to me, you're going to make some subs. I'm telling you, always pay attention to the Inside Edge. That was my best video so far on the show. The Inside Edge is big, man. So anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned for more stub-making videos. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to put out some Battle Royale gameplay soon. So stay tuned for that. Go hit that comment for 10K. Like the video. Subscribe to your boy. We out, everyone. Have a great day and peace.